Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Station Ears on Europa. In our last session, we finished mixing the fuel for a furnace and a combustion centrifuge. We also set up a combustion centrifuge, and I showed how to start it up, shut it down, and eject the ores from it. And I also showed how to set up the vending machine and extract the ores from it. In this session, we need to start looking at expanding our base a bit more. We're a bit crowded around here. I need to be able to expand my growing area to more than these eight hydroponics trays and I need to be able to grow more fruit and veg oh there's a sun up currently we've got some wheat growing oh five wheat that's good yeah that one's not far off we've had one up crop potatoes already from this setup I'm expecting another one soon I only planted one soya bean so we we'll hopefully get some fruit there uh, some seeds and soybeans from there so I can plant them out into additional hydroponic space but yeah I want, I want to expand my base now I've obviously set up my deep mine and combustion centrifuge over there so expand, expanding that way will be challenging but I'm thinking of going down so just clearing some of this area out down here making a stairwell down and making a bit more of a base down there so to do that I need to start off by clearing some space so let's go, how are we doing? Ooh, actually, let's go and uh, replenish our food and water. So food and water, food, potatoes, that's all we really got at the moment. This will do. That gives us our bonus for our water. Okay, so how are we doing over here? You're up to pressure. How am I doing in my suit? Oh, yeah, I'll swap that out. Uh, you can be vented. How are you doing? You're 6,000. You're fine. And I've got some steel frames. Do I have any steel sheets? No, I don't. So I could do some steel sheets. A few more steel frames and a few more steel sheets. So I've got any steel in here. Yeah, plenty of steel. Someone was asking me when I'm going to get stackers. I think it was Charles. Yeah, I do need to get stackers on the end of here. As you can see, I've not got a lot of space at the moment. I need to expand my base before I really get some stackers in. I could put one here, but I have to try and work around that cable. So there's enough of those. I need some steel sheets. Of course I'm going to need 24 of these going to be able to seal them and now I'll need a load of walls but let's get the base down first one more there we go now you can go off um, stairs actually what do I need for stairs iron I've got some iron here So I've printed two of them, I'm not sure if I'm going to need two. My intention is to run the stairs down here, which means I'll have to remove that in the end. But yeah, I'm looking to probably put the stairs there. So let's go. Everything else is fine. Low pressure. Oh. Oxygen low. Except for I'm closing my helmet. Critical. Pressure critical. So, stairwell. Can I put that? Uh, no, not yet. Hmm. Okay, so it's going to take two to come down. Alright, let's start building some walls up. So, I want to come. Down, Ooh, how many? One or two. Let's just go one for now. I 
will still need one in there because I'll be under the stairs. And then I'm one short. Oh, no. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's right. I have good enough. I had the right amount. Let's quickly seal all these up. I need to get down here to seal these back ones up. Is that one done? do two on that one. Ever doing that. There we go. Right, let's get that jetpack off so I can stop being blown around. So what I'm going to have to be careful of here is um, Try not to expand my base too quickly. Because obviously the air is really cold. I could do with this going out another three or four to be honest. Um, and the stairwell is too long. Hmm. Hmm. Just wondering if I want to... No, I do want to bring a stairwell down there. It's just a bit too... Yeah, it's a shame it's too long, or not one long, and I can't place it at the moment because it's interfering with the uh, wall there, but that's fine, I can change all that. I can do that when I remove the f wall up there. What I need to do is start to box this area in, so I need some walls, one, two, three, that's four that way, two that way, two that way, that's four, eight, you get two high, sixteen plus another four. Another eight, sorry, that's 24 walls I need. Do I have any walls pre made? I don't think I do. I think I've used them all. Oh, you really do want to try going at the door, don't you? Okay. You can go in there for safekeeping. Uh, what? Oh, I've got some. No, I've got some steel sheets there. That's useful. How much glass I've got? Six glass. I'm going to need more glass than that. Um, I was going to do put the glass on my backpack. Uh, don't need that cowling. Iron sheets, iron wall kit. Uh, I can make plenty of. Only one iron now. Then it gets expensive. Okay, so I'm going to have to print some more walls. And I'm not going to have enough. So there's any steel anywhere else? I thought I had more steel somewhere. Stellite steel in here. So how are you doing? Are you seeding yet? Five wheat? Five wheat. You know what? We'll take that. fridge isn't big enough. Okay, um, I'll stick the wheat in there. 15 hours it'll last though. How many walls I say I needed? 24. Got 
14. Um, okay, so that's that wheat in there, that growing. Soya, how are you doing? Three soya bean. I want to see if I can get that one to um, seed. It's 18, it's another six more. What was I thinking of? Oh yeah, a uh, fridge. Iron, gold, copper. Gold. Copper. Iron. Oh, I think I made too many of them. Oh, only a couple. That's fine. Plastic? How much plastic have I got? I've got 18 plastic on me. So I need more plastic, so I need more silicon. Plastic sheets. That should be enough plastic sheets. And now glass. Oh, I'm not going to have enough glass. Nowhere near enough. Any more silicon? Yeah. Right, that should be enough glass. The fridge is made. Turn you off. You can go... There. And you know what, I'll stick that wheat straight in there because I'm going to connect it when I'm outside. Because I have the insulated pipes on me. There we go, there's that fridge connected. Nope, no, don't jump up there. Jump up there, jump up there. Go up there. Oh, I want you. Right. Walls. I want windows. Composite window. Actually. That's in the wrong place. What a fool. Um. you done? Nope, not you. I want you. Quick fill these in. All done. Two, four, done. No glass. Yeah, it's in. Thought I'd missed that one then. Yeah, no, it's that. Let's quickly fill these in. Right, um, before I do a stupid thing. Put 
that's uh, uh, centrifuge you can hear then um, I'm just checking before I do walk out I'm just checking that I've sealed all that um, I could do with that so I'm going to hold off sealing that for a moment in fact you know what I'll do it the other way it's made my life a little bit easier Put that in there. And I'll take this window out. Right, it's just so I can get in there. Because I need to get rid of all that cold air in there. And what have I got out here? Oh, it's some stain sheets there I could have used. Never mind. Um, no, no, nothing there. Okay, let's cycle this. Do we have an active vent? Area controller, active vent. There we go. I want that. I've got any cabling. I've got some cabling on me. Uh, I just need a passive vent. Do I have one in here? No. So. Yeah, I'm going to want the iron out of there, I think. Actually, I'm going to want it out of here because I want the silicon. And I want the insulated vent to get. Oh, steel, it's steel, is it? Okay. I thought it was iron. Oh, no, because it's insulated steel, that's right. Take you, switch all these off again. How are we doing on power? Wow, what's drawing all that power? Oh yeah, the <laughs> I know it's drawing that power. It'll be the deep miner. Alright, I got my pass event, let's go back out. Vent can go there. Connect them together. Put them together. Set you to suck. Turn you on. No, oh, it's sucking me in the door. There we go. Now I've just got to let that run for a little while. And that will suck all the air out of that room. Uh, what's the temperature of the gas in you? 24, that's fine. How much have we got? 5.57. Right, leave that running. As you see, the gas is going out that way. It will stop eventually. It's just quite a large area to drain down. I think that is it. I don't know if I can get that switch from the outside, actually. Maybe I should have thought about that. <laughs> can I stick my head through the window? enough to no I can't come on from above 
There we go, turn it off. A little bit of a cheat I know, but it does the trick. So now, if I... Uh, vent, 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 vent. So if you see there's a pass-through vent, I'm just going to stick that on here. And that will now allow some of the gas from here to escape into there. And... Oh, got one. That one. No. That one. Yeah, just checking the pressure in here. Just release some oxygen here to bring the pressure back up. And you know what, I might need some CO2 as well. Where are we at? 50. Yeah, it looks like we're stabilised around about 50, so... Pressure's coming up. I really like it about 60. Just gotta make sure I don't drain this down completely. All this. Yeah, that one's gonna be empty soon. Let's close that. You know what? We'll stick at 55. And now we will... Pop this window. And there we go. We've now got a pressurised base down here. And we didn't freeze our other base, the other side of our base doing it. Okay. Now, can I get the stairwell in? No. So that wall is still in the way. Could see my angle grinder then. You in there, I'm not gonna have to take you down. Which means taking you. You there, you there. That's not in the best place anymore. Um, I will move that <laughs> and that cabling I'll have to move you can probably go it's going to cause some issues initially so what do I call this that's just daylight sensor okay so you to go here so 
so. And this cabling I need to sort out because it's no good going that way. And I want to move that tank of oxygen. So let's get the tank out of the way. Not quite sure I'm going to move it to yet. I might move it down here. Um, and before I do anything stupid, he can come out. And you can come out. Okay, so you can go here. And I'll run the oxygen up that way. So I just need to come around and down. I'm going to move you as well, I think. So pipes, I need some pipes. Just normal pipes. should do the trick. There we go. Um, let's get rid of some of these bits in my hand. I don't need, don't need the glass. Don't need the steel sheets. Don't need the insulated pipes. And I don't need the plastic. Don't need the stairs, additional stairs. And I don't need the walls. I keep forgetting I've got this other backpack on me, you know that. Right, let's sort this out. So first things first, let's... cabling over here that means I can take out take you out and just quickly put you in take all you out and you just need to be a angle like that Pipes. Can run you down here. Now, which one is it? I never remember which one it is. Input. Input two. Pipe liquid, so that's the gas one. So you all like that. There we go. So that's our gas connector back up. Um, like that. Oops, come back here. So that's all that connected up. I need to put you 
like so. Daylight sensor. Oh, don't throw that away. Come back here. Turn you off. Um, let's pick out a well. Okay, so now I just need to fix the programming. And it's more a case of just re pointing this to where it needs to be. So that one is grow light. That's okay. Daylight sensor. Daylight sensor, O2 pump, O2 analyzer. O2 analyzer, there we go. Let's make sure you're not over pressuring. No. You're flicking on and off. And you at 24.8 degrees, that's probably why we're switching on and off. That seems to be working, so I'll just leave that run. That will slowly recharge that, which recharges that. So there we go. We've expanded our base a bit. My water. I want to move that over here because I want to stop putting plants going out that way now. I need to expand the base a bit more before I do that. So that will probably be what we'll do next time. How are we doing here? One soya seed. I want that. Let's get the. So beans, plant two more. Beans can go in there. And a soya seed can go in there. Potatoes. Nope, they're okay, they're not fruiting yet. Oh, they're not seeding yet, so I'll just leave them to seed. Okay, I think that's a pretty good episode so far, so I'm going to leave it there, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, please hit like and subscribe. Please join my channel. I would like more people to join my channel. I'm just about to release a, another video on monetization. I'm thirsty again. I'll sort that out next time. So yeah, uh, leave any comments below uh, and I will respond to you. If you want to see me do something specific, please ask me and I'll have a look at doing that as well. Uh, one thing I do want to do is replace these wind turbines with the big wind turbine. So. Uh, this one here which we'll do next session as well uh, provides more power than these ones I know somebody mentioned it and I know it does but at the beginning I just had room for these only materials for them now we've got the centrifuge going I've got more materials available but thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you next time Dragonfly Gamer wishing you good night <laughs>